Elevan so in this video, be showing you how to fix if you are getting a fatal error in Ninja Guardian 2 Black game. So uh, if you are getting this error on uh, Xbox app, so in this case, what you need to do, press Ctrl, Shift and Escape button from your keyboard and uh, right click on the Xbox app and force close it and also uh, search for the uh, game and right click on it and then press on the in task button, it will force close it. So once you force close it, then uh, don't start the game directly, you need to search for Xbox and uh, then you need to launch the xbox app as an administrator so right click on it and then run the xbox app as an administrator once you once you give admin permission to the xbox app you need to also run the game as an administrator but if you are uh, for, uh, playing the game on steam so follow the same exact step right click on the steam and then run the steam as an administrator and also run the game as an administrator so once you do that and uh, follow this step in the steam case uh, you need to go to the library select collection here you need to find out the ninja guardian 2 black game so i have downloaded the game on xbox but if you have downloaded on steam follow the uh, find the game right click on it go to the properties select install file and click on verify integrity of game file so once the verification is complete then start the game again and check it the issue will be fixed uh, also make sure to update your operating system go to the setting here uh, select uh, update and security and select window update from the side menu Press check for update. If you have any pending update, it will update your operating system to the latest version. And also you need to update your GPU driver. Uh, go to any browser and then search for your GPU and in the last uh, type driver. So open the official website for uh, drivers. So in my case, it's AMD. And uh, then go to the official website, press on download window driver. It will download the latest version or uh, latest driver for your GPU and once you do that restart the device and the issue will be fixed i hope this video helped you subscribe to the channel for more information do like this thanks for watching and see you in the next video